So today uh, we're going to talk a little about the uh, Chinese Communist Party and how they're uh, rewriting uh, portions of the Bible. So uh, I use U version. It's uh, on my phone, and, and there's nothing wrong with using an electronic copy. But I, I'd recommend having a, a physical copy of the Bible as well. It's it's kind of hard to hack, you know, something that's already. You can't you can't hack this. You can destroy it and and you can reprint, but uh, I'd, I'd recommend having a definitely a physical copy. Uh, so what the C CCP is is doing is is re like they've already started rewriting John chapter eight, where Jesus says, uh, "Let whoever is uh, without sin cast the first stone." But then their version of John chapter eight, Jesus goes ahead and stones. The adulterous woman. Uh, if you read John chapter eight, which I encourage you to do, uh, Jesus does not stone this adulterous woman. As a matter of fact, nobody does. Um, yeah, Jesus stoning a woman to death is plain dumb, absolutely dumb. When he actually came to seek and save the lost. But what the Chinese communists party is 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 trying to under undermine the american family uh they have a viral tiktok which i don't do tiktok but you could still watch tiktok videos on like youtube shorts and and all that jazz but what they're doing is this lady's about ready to put her finger in the ring and then she has uh flashes to um basically traditional roles in a marriage you know, it shows her cleaning and taking care of the house and taking care of her kid. And, like, I mean, it's it's constantly going like this. And, but uh, that is actually set up. The, the person who made that video, it, it was from China. And it was, it's aimed at uh, telling these young women that the traditional marriage, traditional family, you know, the movement of fe feminism... It's 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 all a ploy to ruin the foundational bedrock of American society, which is a family. And so, just be mindful of there. There are countries out there that want to see us fall, especially the communist socialist countries, um, China being one of the, one of the biggest ones. And, and if you watch anyone that has, has come over from a communist socialist country, whether it be uh, 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 China, Cuba, uh, like what they did to Venezuela, they try to warn Americans that, hey, I live this. It's real. It's not this pipe dream, this, this nirvana that you think it is. But no, they're they're going to completely come over and jack up what we've got going on, and so that's why I encourage everyone, especially men, to be the well one understand the value of your family and its its foundational uh, role in in building a good society, but also you know guard your family against. All this woke communist crap. It's 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 your job, man, to live alongside with your wife and kids and make sure that they are protected and provided for. And that not f food ain't the only thing that you're supposed to be providing for your family. So once again, the I love the Chinese people, and that's why you know the CCP I, I can't stand. But uh, the, the, the last thing in this is that the preachers, you know, the Christian preachers in China are not deterred by this. They're still going to preach the gospel and spread the love of Jesus Christ to the Chinese people, regardless of if they get imprisoned, put into forced labor camps. And, 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 and we're going to continue to see this explosion of the people put in forced labor camps or prison. Uh, the message of Jesus being spread out. Love you guys.